No steering wheel. No, no steering pedals. wheel. No pedals. No nothing. You are. Uh, you're. This is like being chauffeured, but in the front seat instead of the rear seat. Hey boys and girls, we're here in lovely Los Angeles at Warner Brothers, uh, one of their backstages, and uh, it's quite a nice day, quite a nice setup with all the food and everything. I'm um, looking forward to find out how much we're going to see. A lot of people here that I've talked to are saying that they're hoping to see robots, like real robots, and <clears throat> we're pretty sure we're going to see the uh, Robo Taxi, and some folks are s speculating that we're going to see a Model 2 as well. I'm excited to be here. Finally got in, got my pass. I'm ready to rock. So our autonomous future is, is here. Um, as I said, we've got 50 Teslas driving autonomously. Um, we're trying to give you a sense of what, are, what cities will be like in the future. And uh, when, you, when you get in, you'll see like it's really quite a wild experience to just be in a car with no steering wheel, no pedals, no controls. And it feels great. Um, so, and we, you know, we have enough vehicles here, so everyone should be able to, to try it out and uh, experience the, the, the set that we've built here. Oh, and uh, also, what, 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 what happens if you need a vehicle that uh, is bigger than a Model Y? The, the Robovan. The Robovan is... Uh, this is a, we, we're going to make this, and it's going to look like that. So this can, this can carry up to 20 people, and it can also uh, transport goods. So you can configure it for goods transport within a city, uh, or transport of up to 20 people at a time. And uh, we've made a lot of progress with uh, Optimus. So and, and and what can it do? It can it'll be able to do anything you want. So it can. Um, be a teacher, babysit your kids, it can walk your dog, mow your lawn, get the groceries, just be your friend, serve drinks, um, whatever you can think of. Okay, so here we go. We've picked our destination, and uh, uh, there looks like they're closing up shop here. So we just barely made it uh, with um, with um, uh, getting a ride. And so far, all we had to do was buckle up. And it looks like uh, this isn't exactly a day in May. The, these guys are actually giving you a real ride. No steering wheel. No, no steering pedals. wheel. No pedals. No nothing. You are, uh, you're, this is like being chauffeured, but in the front seat instead of the rear seat. This has been brilliant. Absolutely What is, what is it made out of? Carbon fiber. So the skins are made out of carbon fiber. Um, uh, the, uh, the paneling and whatnot is made out of uh, what you would kind of call a, um, uh, an industrial plastic, so um, because it's made for this kind of use. So at the end of the day, I don't know what we're looking at here, but all these things are blinking like crazy. Oh, uh, light show. Oh, is that what it is? And uh, here we got bicycles. I mean, it's got all kinds of stuff going on, but uh, but I mean, it seems to be avoiding everything. And it also obeys all the road signs. I don't even see. Must thought it was a four-way stop. 
This has been an absolutely brilliant uh, uh, reveal. I, I've, you know, we've been to the, we've been to several of these, but nothing quite like this one. Um, it took a long time for everybody to get their uh, their stuff together, but I'm really, really excited. There we are. Okay, that was great. Thank you very, very much. Thank yeah. you so much for riding. I can't yeah. scooter behind the vehicle for the safety. Yeah, okay, great. Thank you. Yep. Can, can, is it possible to open the deck? Or? Yeah, I can actually open the trunk, but like, I have no access to open the trunk. Sorry about that. You have what? I have no access to open the trunk for oh. today. Sorry about that. Oh, I see. Oh, okay, great. Thank you. Okay, so what you're looking at is a game changer. Um, the future is not going to be um, hard labor. The future is going to be hard labor that's done by a robot. In, um, in the automotive world, you have something called the three Ds. Dirty, dangerous, and drudgery. And those are the three Ds that this, this product, this robot, will get rid of. The three Ds will be gone. This will keep people from injuring themselves needlessly on jobs that are just inhumane. That's an inhumane product. It's a, it's a robot. And that's what we need. We need this to take the place of dirty, dangerous, and drudgery. This has been really dramatic. I, I was expecting a lot of stuff, but I wasn't expecting this. The, uh, the taxi is to die for. The, uh, the amazing amount of technology that we've seen here today is stunning. No steering wheels, no brake or, or accelerator pedal, no, uh, uh, no side mirrors, no mirrors, period. Everything here is saying, Tesla is going to clobber the marketplace. And this, I can't even, I can't bring myself to tell you how excited I am at looking at this. For anybody that's out there that knows about design in the 30s, this is so Art Deco, it ain't even funny. I love this. I love it. Look at this thing. This thing holds, holds 14 people. It rises. I, I don't need to, I don't need to see it move. I can tell you what it's going to do. It's going to lift up because it's got an air suspension system after you get in. When, it, when you stop, it's going to come back down, and when it comes back down, it'll be easy exit. My guess is one side's got steps and the other, the other side will have a ramp for, uh, for handicap. This is spectacular. So at the end of the day, this was a great trip. Thank you, uh, Tesla, Elon Musk, all the, uh, all the guys here, all the great guys that that Tesla that helped me out. <clears throat> this has been brilliant. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more. Bye.